good morning. It's too early for me to even intro this video. I think it's 7 a.m. at latest, but I'm gonna show you all how to have a successful day or start your day off the successful way. Greens, creatine. Hydration. Mm. Ah. Add some coffee. I'm buzzing though. We have chest today, people, and I'm gonna get a membership to uh, to that old school gym I trained legs in two days ago. I'm excited. I'm excited to turn into Ronnie Coleman. Okay, what's up, people? Day five of the bulk. Day one, however, of road to four plate bench. We're gonna bench today. I'm heading back up to uh, to the gym I trained legs in the other day. I'm fucking with that. It's old school, it's good, it's well lit. The only thing is, it could be a hit or miss some days. Some members could be in there blasting music and it's not ideal when you're doing mic'd up videos. But um, I'm excited, bro. I have the first wind done. I got in, got all everything trained, the first rotation of training done. I'm over the doms, took a rest day yesterday. And I'm considering, I'm considering, highly considering, moving to a bro split as of today. Or maybe we're leaning towards it, so I might do chest and just side delts. Uh, and then tomorrow, back and rear delts. And then the day after that, I might just tap rear delts, or just delts and arms. So just tap rear and side delts, but like train front delts and do a full arm workout, and then legs again. It just gives like a little bit more rest in between the sessions. Plus, I think next week, yeah, I'm gonna fully move to a bro split, so I'll have chest on a day, I'll have back the next day, I'll have shoulders and arms, and then legs, so I won't be tapping anything on the chest, but there'll be more volume, you know? I just don't think I can handle that shit right now. Um, but I'm excited. We have one scoop of legend right now, two scoop pump. My bad, bro. I was uh, at a dead stop on a green light. <laughs> but I'm excited, man. Let me know right fucking now what you weigh and what your max bench is. It doesn't have to be now, but what you, what your max bench ever was and what weight you were hitting that max bench. I want to see if we have some strong motherfuckers watching these videos. I guess that's it, man. We're going to go down and, and absolutely annihilate chest. Today, what day is it? What fucking day? It's Saturday. It's Saturday. We have a busy day after this, so yeah, it's an early session. It's 10 a.m. right now. 10 a.m. with this bitch! I'm so excited, man. I have a feeling that the pump today is gonna be it's gonna be extraordinary compared to the last chest day. Because I'm 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 four days on on the bulking calories. Food's moving, I can feel it. I'm in on that pot at least six times a day. Everything's moving. You know? Carbs is in. Actually, I'm fasted right now. Fuck! I'm fasted. I am fasted right now. Just because it's an early session, I have shit to do later. Which is not ideal. I solemnly swore that I'd be eating one meal. At least one meal before training. Two hours before, get some good carbs in, good fats. A little bit of protein. Everything to assist the pump. But um, I have 30 grams of peanut butter. A banana with a suspicious amount of salt. And some, and a dream in a shaker. My man with a dream right now. Let's get to the fucking gym, and let's put up three plates. If I put up three plates, give the drop a like on this video, man. It's also a beautiful day in Costa del Dublon. It will probably last 10 minutes, and then it could be a fucking hailstorm. All right, people. Chest day. Here we go, people. Day motherfucking one. 
of row to a four plate bench. I have no idea how long this might take. I could go ahead and hit a four plate bench in a month. Could take two months, three months. Uh, plan for today though, we're gonna bench, obviously. I'm feeling an incline machine press. Probably some sort of fly. Could do cables, there is, there's a pec deck over there, two, two forms of pec deck. I'll see what I'm feeling when we get to that point. And then just some side delts, man. Some probably dumbbell laterals. And if there is a machine in here, I'd like to do some machine um, side laterals, basically. But yeah, my plan of action. We're just gonna go play. I'd say play for play, but that would send me into the A&E quick, fast. I'm gonna go 10, 20, 10, 20. Just keep adding like that until we get up to three plates. That's the plan. I also have um, elbow sleeves. Well, they were knee sleeves that now fit my elbow, so I've leveled up, man. 10 prestige on this shit. You know, that's probably the smart thing to do is accumulate all the weights I'm gonna use, so I'm not walking around in between sets, burning energy, man. A little tactic I'll always use on chest day, especially when I'm benching. And I like swear by it, it's just, when you warm up properly for a bench, that session is gonna be way better than if I just came in lobbing plates on. It's two sets of 50 with just the bar. Shout out to Christian Guzman for that one. Trained with him back in, I think it was 2021. And yeah, he swore by it too, two sets of 50 with just the bar and it just gets everything it almost like you break a sweat doing it and then nothing's cold try it out though if you've um like if you're just warming up with, with the bar for 12 reps you're not really elevating your heart rate or getting warmed up in my opinion so two sets of 50 100 reps and they're like fast paced reps too so gets everything warmed up nice Nice. Alright, I guess it's play. Play for half a play for plate right now. The first, you could say, working set. Um, I'm probably not going to show the sets I do with just the 10s when I'm slapping 10s on in between the plates because I'm only doing like five reps. And that's another thing to uh, consider is you want to be trying to save as much energy as possible for whatever top set you have in mind so for me it's just one rep of three plates if two is there or whatever if i'm feeling another rep i'll go for it but um i'm taking this year slow and fucking steady people uh, we have a lot of time to grow a lot of time to get stronger i don't want to come in here and snap my shit up on day one um but yeah first set plate each side three reps at most and you'll notice as well I treat each one of these reps as if this is the three plates already on this bitch explosions okay do another set with tens on then I'll slap two plates on each side also got a tee off, off the owner. Barbarian to XL, this man knows it. Oh yeah, I'm feeling it today. Also keep in mind, some of these plates are like 21 kilo, 20.9, 22. So it's actually gonna be more than a three plate bench. Two plates, 
this is usually what I get a feeler or like in the future when I'm when I'm like going for I don't know higher than a three plate bench I'll always be able to gauge the workout off how quick two plates move This is gonna be the last set before we go for it, people. I'll, uh, I'll put wrist straps on for this set. Maybe elbow sleeves for the three plates. Just one rep of this. Straight onto uh, the three plates. Yeah. That was nice. Free plate bench. Happy to take this today. Because again, I know I'm only gonna get a lot stronger over the next few weeks. So you know what, even if this fails, like I could bang out two reps, I'm gonna take one, man. Take small Ws as they come. Okay. Okay, I'll take it. Okay, the heavy, heavy lift is done for the day. Now I want to chase like some good quality reps. Get a nice ass pump, tear the chest up. And I'm happy man, come in, hit the press. Hit the press I'm going for. And then after that, it's all, it's all fun and games. Okay, let's get some incline going. I'm gonna do some uh, some incline dumbbells today. I was gonna do machine press, but you'll you'll notice like I'll switch from time to time. But today I'm just feeling some dumbbells, so I'm gonna do some dumbbells. Sure what this is. 37.5. Okay. Ooh. I'm definitely toast after that, that heavy benching because usually I would fuck about the 50 kilos on this. That was 37.5. I'm gonna go to the 40s and just get some good reps. Okay, they don't have the 40s, so we're going with 45. I can feel the pump though. <laughs> wow. Okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
one more set of that. Might do a drop set and then get on and absolutely tear the chest up with some flies, man. I think that's it for incline pressing. Get on now, maybe do um, make some cables. Finish off chest with some good old cable flyers after the heavy pressing. All I'm really going for now is trying to get as much blood into the muscle as possible. Get the biggest pump I possibly can. Yeah, simple as that. I need to complicate it. Two sets on that and then let's check out the damage I I can already tell. This pump is gonna be ridiculous. I haven't had a pump like this in a long ass time. check out this bump okay I can imagine this being a six spot we have natural lighting right here above me let's get the tarp off shall we the ball's ass out wow I haven't had a pump like this in a minute <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm seeing a huge difference between today and the last day. Huge fucking difference. It's basically chest wrapped up. It's time to uh, get some side delts done now, lads. I've been through the stage of obsessing over heavy shoulder pressing, and um, I've personally noticed way more growth in the delts when I pulled back on the shoulder pressing and focus more on on the lateral movements the rear delt movements especially for like a full round ass 3d fucking shoulder shoulder presses alone ain't gonna get you that shit i would um i'd get in get a couple of sets of shoulder press and then the rest of uh of shoulders will be chasing the motherfucking pump on some shit like side laterals Upright rows, face pulls, bent over flies. Um, just blew my shoulders the fuck up. Another thing as well is I, I don't go heavy on this shit. I'm seeing, I'm seeing people way smaller than me uh, come in here and, and be lateral raising 20 kilos, like 45 pounds and shit like that. You're wondering why your fucking delts aren't growing because you're probably not working them. Motherfuckers in here doing shrugs. I like to really isolate on this. 
feel every fucking rep. Volume, volume, volume for shoulders. Yeah, a couple of sets of this. Maybe another side out movement and the kid is done, man. Day five will be a wrap. Rap ski. I'm fucking with this gym though. What we saying about this gym, I did after finishing the dumbbells. I said, you know what, let me jump on that incline press. Let me just see how it feels, see what I missed out on. And I fucking missed out. So I'm scrapping off the dumbbells. I'm probably gonna do that bitch on the next chest day. Let me know if you notice a difference in the physique from today and the last chest day. And again, the subs haven't even kicked in, man. I'm five days in, I'm expecting that shit to kick in about day 14. Do a drop set. One more set with this, whatever the fuck this is. Five and a half. And then straight into a drop set. Probably, probably a giant drop set. I'm feeling this. Shit. are honestly <laughs> seven by fives about where am I sorry Steven I apologize for the inconvenience Oh yeah, I'm feeling it. This is gonna be an interesting few weeks, man. Whew, one more thing for side delts. There's a um, machine lateral. I'm, on, I'm gonna do that downstairs. Just to target like the short range. And then that should be a wrap on day five. This is a, uh, we're taking dub after dub at these sessions. We had the four plates on the squats. Three plate bench today. And the rest is just the aim, man. Just have fun, people. Like, set little goals, hit them. And then for the rest of your workout, chase the pump, have fun. Again, adherence is number one in this game. The motherfucker in the gym for the next 20 years is, is gonna get a whole lot further than the person in here letting logbook numbers affect them, missing workouts. You can get in a shrub for weeks on end. If you're letting numbers dictate the game, just come in, hit what you can, give your best every single fucking day. Let's have fun with this shit, man. Yeah. All right, let's hit some, uh, let's hit some machine laterals.
that feels insane. It'll probably go a bit heavier. Take a home, people. Fuck. This machine feels really good. Oh. Last Saturday. Yeah, it's like the home get some calories up in us, man. I'm fasted. I'm hungry as fuck right now. I might even jump on that stairmaster after this. Get the 20 minutes done. Because I know the rest of the day is busy and I do not want to wear. Uh, even consider missing out on cardio. Last set of the motherfucking day. That's it. I guess that's it. Uh, let's see if this thing even works. Oh, wow. It's not. Day five. Day one of row to a four plate bench is a success. I'll take three plates for the one rep today. Lads, once I hit a four plate bench and and a six place squat. You will probably never hear from me again. I appreciate all the love and support over the years, but I will have completed it, mate. It's all side quests from that point forward. <laughs> I'm happy with I'm happy with the three plates today though. I'm I'm fully I'm I'm patient as fuck this time around. If I go in and, and take small W's like that every single week, it's only a matter of time, isn't it? But if I go in and be an idiot. And like overdo it, that's only gonna slow me down. Uh, and when it comes to like accessories and shit, like the uh, the dumbbells and and the incline machine, I just noticed an extra plate spawn onto the machine, or an extra ten kilos spawn onto the dumbbells in my hand every few weeks. Um, I just get strong as fuck on those lifts, naturally with the more calories and and the consistency of the lift. I don't ever have to. Uh, to track that type of shit just get stronger on it but when it comes to like the bench and the squat and if there was deadlifts in the plan I have a number in mind if I go in and hit that number and I go home in one piece hallelujah that's a successful day but uh, yeah that's it day 5 chest side delts tomorrow's going to be back rear delts then we'll do like shoulders and arms it will mainly be a press and then just tapping side and rear again probably shouldn't but I just want to get that I can't just go in and just do arms it'll be like a fucking 15 minute workout and um, so just to press one side delt one rear delt arms then legs and then after that it's the bro split yeah I'm ready for that shit I should be ready for the volume then all the uh, all the doms will be have will be have can I speak English after these sessions please we'll be we'll be done from taking the two weeks off body will be back to back to being used to training and then it's all systems go we'll have been a week in a surplus so we'll start to creep in shit's about to get fucking fun buckle up man appreciate the support on the uh, on the daily uploads too i haven't even checked views i'm i'm reading comments and shit though every day so if you drop a comment 
I will definitely see it. And yeah, just a big switch up in content. It's it's risky for, for creators, but I know I'm enjoying the fuck out of this. So I'm just uploading and going. Yeah, yeah, that's it, people. I will see you a lot tomorrow for day six. Go home now, eat some fucking tuna. Probably too much sweet corn. And that's all she wrote. Get some bagels up in me. Yeah, some bagels. Sesame seed bagels. Yeah! Okay. <laughs> I'll see you a lot tomorrow, man. Bye.